So we're back to the second part of this session. We are on page 151. We're using this whiteboard to write something on it and you can use your books in order to follow up with what I'm saying. So here is it. It is talking about now the plural subjects. Whenever we have and, then it is plural, regardless of whether what comes before is singular or not. It's simply plural. And this is why we have art parked. Both tigers and elephants are becoming ex uh, extinct. In fact, it's not because we have an, an S with elephants that is becoming here plural. It is not because we have and, but because we have both. This is the, the main element that we have here. Several, many, both, few, all of them are words that are plural, and they take a plural, plural verb all the time. There's nothing else that can happen to them. Both are going, uh, a few have passed the exam, regardless. Next page, 152. We have some nouns that are always plural and should always take plural verbs, but they refer to only one thing, for example, clothes, like trousers. If you translate into Arabic here, it becomes the problem. Would you say trousers, pantalon, or bintal, or sirwal, or غير ذلك? Sunglasses, you can say nadara or nadarat. It, it refers to one thing, but in English, it's a plural all the time, although it refers to singular. We have scissors, for example. Scissors, مقص. We don't say مقصات. And still, in English, you have to say plural, although it refers only to one مقص and not to two scissors, for example. Abstract words like riches, riches yeah, means al ghina, thanks, shakurat, or shay, means, which means asalib, something. It's always plural anyway, even if it refers to singular. And we have such ex uh, ex special expressions like a pair of or a word of, uh, some of them maybe just. Uh, to, to talk about the, uh, the singular. For example, we say his pants are still at the cleaners, and you can say that pair of pants is dirty. The pair, now here, the rule says you look at what comes before of. May say you have a question, please. You have the microphone. Oh, sorry. Um, I was raising my hand to answer the first question. No, no, we so, don't have any questions sorry. at the moment. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you very much. Now we will drop the hands and we will wait for just, just a moment. So we have now these questions. One, two, three, four, five. Who would like to answer one and two? And the question is again is and uh, Mesa, yes, please. Okay. Uh, number one, few all. You are strong enough to finish the race. Number two. What about number two? Uh, there is a, 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 a is there is a yes, pair there is of a pair of, uh, This is because we rule. The rule says if there is a subject that uh, has all, you just uh, yeah. what comes before uh, uh, before the word uh, of. Thank you very much. Now we move to number three and four. Shirin, this is the first time you talk, and I will give you gladly. I will give you the microphone. Shirin, you have the mic. Uh, thanks so much. Uh, for number three, this and my uh, objects are. Uh, for number four, many of you are going to school. So the, the same. The same on the yeah. Just to have a question. First of all, we will just explain. Um, I want to ask about uh, um, the case uh, plural or. Or, or singular well, uh, just, I just had yeah. some problem in hearing you because of the disconnect. Maybe there is a kind of disconnection or something. Could you please repeat what's your question? Okay, shall I repeat what I have said? Yes, please. There is a kind of delay in getting uh, my words to you or getting your words to me. So, could you please repeat? Yes, your question. Okay. Yeah, my question about means, does it take singular verb or plural verb? It's a plural. Uh, it's means is. You say means is usually. Yeah, it's like means, means of transportation, for example. Transport, a means of transportation or means of transportation. In fact, uh, it is sometimes singular, sometimes plural, but we have to check with the dictionary all the time to look it up in the dictionary. 
and it will tell me that uh, a means of doing something is a method. Can you see? So uh, it is singular, as you say, and it can be sometimes plural, wasa'at instead of uh, anyway. Usually we use it, uh, I think you would right to say that there is problematic here because it should be sometimes singular, sometimes plural, I don't know. But is it, is mm -hmm. it, so is it countable? Maybe it depends on context. It's countable. It's maybe countable. it depends. Noun countable, yes. So it depends on the context to say whether we're talking about means as well, if or not. That's right. Anyway, uh, thank you, Shirin, uh, for your participation. I will now move to another person. Abdullah, would you like to do number four or five? Number four and five, please. Uh, sorry, uh, not uh, Abdullah, sorry, yes. Yeah, okay. Uh, about number five, uh, many of you are going to suffer above five hundred on the TOEFL. Score above five hundred in on the TOEFL. This is the old TOEFL, by the way. So yeah, the but I have some inquiries, please. Can I? Many, yes, please. Yeah, I have some inquiries about uh, trousers. You, you know about what? Yeah, about uh, trousers. Trousers. Can I use it like? Yeah, can I use it like uh, a pair of trousers? Because I have near. Yes. Yeah. You can say yeah. a pair okay, of trousers. Okay, this one. If you're talking yeah. about uh, trousers, it's a pair. Yeah. The second thing, uh, you know, there is few, and if you follow that that rule. Use it to uh, use after it uh, R instead of is, right? So, what about a few? A few, we yeah. Have, we have here a few or a few. Both of them have, both of them talk about, uh, talk about plural because a few people, a few people. And then what about uh, have attended the meeting, for example? A few or few people have attended the, the, the meeting. It's simply plural all the time, few, few, a few, whatever. Yeah, and I think I can follow the same rule with little and a little, right? Well, I think uh, little is totally different because little is uh, little is uncountable, so it should be little mm. sugar is enough. You can say because it, fo it it talks about uncountable things, and a little is enough, so it's singular all the time. We will have this rule later on, maybe I don't, I'm not sure. This book talks about it certainly, but maybe in the next uh, in the next few pages. Thank you very much, Abdullah. Unless you have any other question, we can move to another person because we do not have much time here. But thank you for your question. Yes, a little and little are the opposite of few and a few. Okay, now we have number six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, and here it says that we have some problems because it says the question says that we have a problem with the verb. Could it be was? Could it be where? So the now uh, I would like to ask Maha, please. Yes, can you please, Maha? Number <coughs> six okay. and seven. Um, okay, that pair of you glasses, sunglasses, was very expensive. Um, okay, it seems right um, because that there is singular. Uh, and it takes a singular verb. So you say it seems right. In fact, it doesn't seem right. It is right already because this is per it's singular and was a singular. Number seven. Okay. When the per ran, a few were still working in the test. Okay. Um, uh, it, it's right because few takes a plural uh, verb. Yes, because few and were is, is okay. Thank you very much. I think we can move now to another person. This time we will ask uh, Mesa to talk and after Mesa we have Ali, after Ali we have Amani. Yes. Uh, number eight is incorrect uh, because uh, it should be uh, uh, the screwdriver uh, was, left, was left out. Simply because along with the pliers doesn't make any problem with us. It doesn't affect the subject, the subject is still a singular. No, yes, number nine. And uh, number nine is uh, appears, uh, is uh, incorrect because it should be appear because several uh, takes plural. Several of the fish, yes, appear to be dying for several is simply 
it's simply plural. Yes, Heather is plural. Thank you very much for your participation. Yeah. We will ask now, we have uh, three people. Uh, before, yes, Maysa, Ali, Amani, 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 and Sarah. First of all, we start with Maysa. Please, Maysa, yes. Okay, uh, could I uh, uh, answer number uh, 10? Please, number 10, yes. Uh, okay, uh, it is incorrect. Um, because the scissors uh, take uh, all. Yes, it always takes all. Thank you very much, uh, Mesa. Now we move to Ali, and after Ali, we move to, Ama uh, to Amani. Now, uh, before we start with this exercise, we explain the rule here. Now we have a problem with the word neither nor. We talked about either or neither, but we didn't talk about either or, neither nor. Now here we have the rule which is called rule of proximity. Rule of proximity. For example, neither the students nor the teacher, and here we have is allowed to smoke. So what the, it doesn't make sense maybe because we have neither or either. So what's, what's the problem? What's the issue here? The issue is that we, we apply the rule of proximity in grammar. It's called proximity, by the way, and all linguists know about it. It means that we have two parts of the subject. One of them is plural, for example, and the second one is singular. What decides the is to be and is, in fact, the closest. It is the closest one. It is simply the closest one to is. So you look at one which is close, and then you can say is. This is, we're talking about neither nor. And we're talking about either or, not only, but also. And we have another rule which is a bit complica complicated, which is all of and all. If you say all people, all people, it's always simply plural. If you say all of, it has a different story. All of, you forget about all of, you look at what comes after of. Here we have the book, so it's singular. If we have books, it's a plural. If, if it's uncountable, it's always singular as well. All of the money is in the bank. We don't say it's are in the bank. They're a bit complex, I know. I know this is English. A number of students were missing from class. I think we talked about it in the exercise. We had some exercises that said there is a number of, or the number of, and I said to you, it's explained in these papers. The number is always singular, but a number of is always plural. And I hope that you would study this material more and more. So we would like to have, first of all, we have Ali and Amani, and then we will have Aya uh, and Abdullah, if I, hopefully I will not forget the order. Number one, uh, did you say Ali or Maysa or Um? I told you I would forget anyway. Uh, we will start with Ali, please. Number one and two. Thank you. Uh, yeah, number one, neither the doctor nor the nurses are here. Yes, you have to say are because simply we're talking about we're talking about proximity, so it's R. If you say neither the nurses nor the doctor is going to be is, definitely. Number two, Ali, what do you say here? Okay, okay number two, uh, the number of nurses in the city is very large. Thank you very much, Ali. This is a correct answer. And we will now move to, to Amani. Yes, Amani, number three and four. Amani, we cannot hear you. I'm sorry, we cannot hear you, Amani. So we go to, I think we have Mesa. After Mesa, we will have Amina. But let's start with Mesa. Mesa, yes. Okay, and number three, all, all of the nurses are very good. Okay, and all. we have to say are here. Okay, that's fine. What about all the medicine? All of the medicine? Uh, all of the medicine is, is gone. All of the medicine is gone because of the rule which says so. So, with your permission, I will just, just to ask Amina, because she's here again, she's raising her hand, she hasn't spoken yet, so... I hope there is no problem with the mic again, because I'm not going to exit this seminar. I'm sorry, Amina, there is a problem with the microphone, I cannot unmute you. 
Yeah, there's a problem, I don't know. So, uh, Abdullah, can you please answer the remaining two? Also, we have some of the water and most of the money. Is a question for me? Yes, this question is for you. Uh, the question yeah, says we have I... five and uh, six, some of the yeah, water okay. and most of the money. Can you please just uh, yeah. share with us your thoughts? Okay. okay, number five, some of the water is used for irrigation. Because water is uncountable, yes, that's right. Yeah, uncountable. The most number six, money. most of the money is counterfeit. Is counterfeit. It's right. is counterfeit, yes, it is counterfeit, so uncountable. Uh, it is uncountable. Thank you very much, Abdullah. I think we have now, let's give the floor now to Shireen and then to Amira and then to, to whoever talks, no problem. Shireen, yes, please, number seven and eight. Hey, number seven. Not only the money, but also the jewels are looked up in the safe. And why did uh, you say number, is, why Because the jewels... Is, yeah, because jewels, yeah. it's uh, what because the closest, proximity. It's proximity. Yeah, because the closest... Because of proximity. Yeah. Because, just please remember this word, it's proximity. The opposite of proximity is alienation, but anyway, we're talking about proximity here. And uh, number eight, uh, neither the jewels nor the money Money is mine. Is mine, and also because of proximity, and money is uncountable. Thank you very much. Thank you, Shireen. Now we move to, I, I just lost the count. I think Fatima. We can take Fatima because she hasn't talked too much today. We did not give you the chance uh, to talk today. Yes, number nine and ten. Uh, all of the kids are gone. Uh, half of the furniture is in the car. And what's the rule here? Are, are the rule number nine says when we have all of then we have to look at yeah. what comes after of and okay. half of we look at what comes also of uh, half of after half of this furniture which is simply all the time singular thank you very much uh, Fatima we move forward we're now on page 154 it's a bit confusing here but anyway Amounts, money, weights, anything, all of them are singular, whatever. So you say two weeks, you say is enough. $500 is enough. 10 extra pounds is enough. 20 gallons is enough, although all of them just simply end with an S. They still are, they still are singular because they talk about an amount of something. And we have some words, I think, it goes without saying. When you say mathematics, you don't say mathematics are, you say is. Names of books like New York Times, Star Wars, etc., all of these things, I think they are understood. It goes without saying that those words are all the time in the singular, not in the plural. Now we will ask Amira to answer number one and two. Amira, please. And we are on page 154. Okay, then this is the quotes read, quotes on the wrong, incorrect. So, German measles cause red spots on the chest and arms. What's wrong with that, you said? Uh, um, incorrect uh, uh, causes. Causes because measles is singular, not plural. That's all. What about the news of the peace talks has not yet reached the island? Um, um, correct. Yes, it's correct because news is always singular and not plural. Yes. Thank you very much. You answered these questions. Uh, we have a message from. Sana, uh, she is trying to answer all these questions. Unfortunately, Sana, as I said in the, in the past, we have a problem. We do not look into the chat frequently because it will cover the whiteboard that I'm writing on and it's going to be a problem for me. I'm very sorry I cannot see all your answers and it doesn't work in this way. We have all the time to talk. 
there's no other way I'm sorry we have to talk so that I can see you I can hear you otherwise it would be impossible and I can see some of the answers at least or maybe all of them are really correct answers I'm sorry I'm sad for what is happening to you but you have to fix this problem yourself so that we can all hear your voice this is the only way that we have remember nothing in the screen will, will, will appear on the recording for that reason we just speak uh, now we would like to move to Amani. Amani, please. Could you please, Amani, answer the number three and number four? Yes. Um, politics usually attracts, so the verb um, yes, it's is supposed to be singular. It's, it's supposed to be... Yes. Uh, number four um, is correct. Not before is correct because the copies, copies here, it is the... Plural sing, uh, form. Thank you very much. Anyway. Hala Sharif has raised her hand and he hasn't talked so far, so I will give her the floor and I will move later on to Fatima because she hasn't talked too much also. Uh, she simply is here. Hala, you have the microphone, Hala. Yes, I think we. One moment. Hala, you have the microphone, but unmute yourself to talk. Hala, you have the microphone, but you need to unmute yourself. You're still muted. Not by me, but by you. Yes, you are unmuted. You can talk now. Okay, Hala, there is a problem with your microphone or with the equipment. I cannot hear you at all. I think there's a problem. I'm sorry for that. Now we will move to Fatima. Fatima, could you please do the next two ones, which is number five and six? Uh, okay. Two weeks are under time for a championship to the state park. Uh, it's correct. No, it's not correct because when you say two weeks, it is is. We said that we're talking about amounts. Amounts we say two weeks is. We don't say two weeks are. Thank you very much anyway, but number six. According to the champion, 100 pounds are easy to lift. I think it's correct. No, it's also wrong because it should be is. <laughs> Sim simply because two weeks is a period of time, and the period of time is always singular. Uh, we have 100 pounds, it's also an amount of weight or something like this, then it is also singular, thank you very much. We, we need sometimes to make mistakes so that we explain them. Number 7 and 8, and I would like to ask now uh, Mr. Uh, Abdullah, please, can you please answer this question, number 7 and 8. Yeah, number 7 and 8 uh, are correct, because, yes, you know, $2,000. Singular. Two thousand dollars is a lot of money. There is singular. And what about the second one? The second one is correct also because both mathematics and physics are interesting. We are talking about two types of like. Uh, it's not a matter of two physics types. And no, not about two types. It's a matter simply of talking about both. Simply, we have both. Yeah. Then it is plural in the type, regardless of what comes after them. Uh, of course, what you're saying is, yeah. is, is correct, but I would just wanted to be more technical in answering this question. Thank you very much. Now we have the final number nine and number eight. Uh, number nine and number ten, and we will have those who raise their hands. Ali, Ali, can you please answer this question? Number nine and number ten. It's my pleasure to answer these questions. Number nine is correct, and number ten is incorrect. <laughs> is incorrect. So the first one is correct. Why is it correct? But we have Joe's. Because we have to yeah, Joe's. Uh, yeah. It's maybe a book or... Joyce was seen by a recording. Maybe, yes. What about the second one? Yeah. You say it's incorrect. Why? Mumps. Uh, incorrect. So Why is not to be incorrect? Because, uh, because mumps is no calf. It's a type of disease or something. Thank you very much, Ali. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mr. Ali. So... We have some other words that can be plural and singular, species, species. The deer is sometimes used as singular, sometimes as plural, sheep, deer. 
And sometimes we have other words that are collective words like crew, like team, like whatsoever. And we would like just first of all, I will drop your, I will lower your hands, and then I will ask you now once again, who would like to answer these questions? It says that when you have such words like correct collective words like a crew, you cannot decide immediately if it's singular or plural. Uh, you have to see the rest of the sentence. So, what do you think, Ali? Number one, you have the microphone, Ali, but you have to unmute yourself. Yeah, number one, are the crew are asleep in their bunks down the hall of the ship. Why did you say are, not is? No. Because you are talking about a member of the crew, not. Uh, no, about not, the concept because, of the crew. I not think. because we're talking about members, because we have the in the sentence. So we have a clue, oh, yeah. a textual clue that we have to use there. Now, what about number two? Number two also are. Number two are because? Several. Because we have several. Of species. species. Yes, several. Because several. We're talking about plurals. Thank you very much. This is a good, a good answer. We move now to number three, and number four, we have Sarah. Yes, Sarah, you can talk. Um, yes, we will be allowed you is motionless. And why do you say is? Uh, number why it's talk about uh, young deer and the, uh, the second part of the, of the sentence uh, it's according to uh, it's, it's yeah thank so you yeah, that's, that's correct yes we have it's and we have a number four yeah. number four the comment is ready to me uh, the comment it's single. It's not comment. Comment it's means within the committee means legna. So the comment. committee is ready to make yeah. a recommendation. Recommendations public. So how do you know it's is not are? Of the subject uh, singular, and uh, uh, already there there is x. Yes, because we have it. Thank you very much. You've yeah. got the answer. You made the answer correctly. Uh, I think I lowered the hands of some people by mistake. Could you please raise your hand so that I can see you again? Yes, thank you very much because I, by mistake, I just simply dropped you. We have now Maha, please Maha, number five and number six. Okay, uh, both apparatus apparatus are available for your use. I think that uh, I think that it is R. Both apparatus both are. Both apparatus are because simply we have R, uh, both. Both. What the family? Uh, number number six, uh, the family um, uh, are fighting among themselves constantly. The family are fighting among themselves because simply we have themselves, themselves. so we have this clue. Number seven, thank you very much. Number seven, number eight, I would like to ask now, uh, Mesa, could you please talk? Uh, the fish in the aquarium are waiting for the fish their in the daily feeding. Are waiting for their or. daily feeding because we have there. What about uh, number eight? Uh, it uh, yes, because it's thank you very much. Thank you very much. That's correct. We move now to the next exercise. Now, some words have Latin origins and you cannot guess really. You have to memorize them. For example, Criterion, this is singular, criteria is plural, phenomenon, singular, phenomena is plural. You have to memorize them, there's nothing else you can do. So we have number one here, number two, who would like to do them. Could you please raise your hands again if you want to answer these questions? Let me just lower the whole bunch of hands that we have. I'd like to see the chance if there's something. Yes, uh, Sarah, thank you for uh, for giving us these answers uh, and we hope that we can hear your voice next time. Abdullah, please. Number one and number two, alumni of the university, yes. Is it is? Is it are? Yeah, but uh, don't you know the 
the yeah, plural this thing is, for alumni. Yeah, this, is, is, this is the problem, yes. This is the this yep. is why the, these words are problems. Alumni, alumni is the plural of alumnus, and alumnus means khirij, yep. alumni khirij one. Yeah, I forget that. I, I was remember that. Okay, uh, I will answer this question alumni. and I will give myself a very big clap for that. So move to number okay. two. No, ah, this is your specialty. <laughs> These yeah. bacteria being studied by university scientists, yes. Are being yes. studied by university scientists? Simply because the Are. singular is bacterium, not bacteria. Thank you very much, Abdullah. Thank you very much, Jumana. I'm very pleased that you will talk, Jumana. This is, I think, the first time you talk, and I hope that I will be able to give you the mic. Yes. Jamana, you have the microphone. This is, well, this, is happy day. this is a happy day because this is the first time I hear your voice. Yes, please. Number three and number four. No, oh, this is not a happy day now because it's disconnected, something like this. Jumana, are you with us? Jumana, oh, I'm sorry. Is Yes. English. Is heard all over the world, yes, that's... that's is right. heard all over the world. And what's about the... Portuguese? Portuguese, this is the number of people. Yeah, this is the people. Portuguese you people. did. Yes. Are fortunate to have such a beautiful slide. Yes, are fortunate to... Uh, sorry. The Portuguese are fortunate to have such a beautiful slide. Thank you very much, Jamana. It's very good to hear your voice. And uh, we would like to see now. Uh, we have Sarah first, and then we will move to two other people. Or uh, one moment. Okay. Sarah, would you like to help us with number five and number six? Well, it's very easy. It starts with many, regardless of what we have okay. next. It starts with many, so it must be our living. What about number six? Are you with us? Sarah, are you with us there? Are you there? I cannot hear you well. I'm sorry for that, uh, Sarah. Maybe there's a problem. Uh, I move to Fatima. Could you please, Fatima, tell us number six and number seven? And this is page 156. Yeah. Criteria for the identities is, uh, are usually found at the point of a book. So it's R because this is a, a Latin or a Greek or whatsoever. Words so the criteria for promotion are clearly stated, and the appendices and the appendices is simply a plural. The appendix is so we have to say, R. thank you very much. Uh, the singular is appendix, and the plural is appendices. Okay, uh, now we move to something else. I will just skip this one because it's the same, it's a repetition, and we will move now to the next exercise. And here we have again A, B, C, D, one of them is wrong, and we have to know why. I, I'm not sure if you can hear me well because, according to my device, we have problems with the connections. It is 4G, but it seems to be 4G is slower than the turtle itself. Anyway, new ways of just cheating on people and asking to pay more, getting worse service. I hope that you can hear me well. So my question is, uh, now we have four things. Abdullah, you cannot hear me? Please write something, Abdullah. You said no, no sound, you cannot hear. Okay. Can you hear me now? So, if you can hear me, which is good. I would like to ask you now, all of you, to see those sentences. Number one, where is the mistake? 
They do not necessarily have to do with the subject, verb, etc. It could be anything. We will start with now we have four. We have Abdullah, Maysa, Fatima, and Ali. We will start with Abdullah first. Let's start with Abdullah, number one. Uh, let me read it. Uh, it's me. The ability to conceal themselves by camouflage enable some otherwise defenseless survive. animals to survive. survive yes. Okay. Where is the mistake? Um, I think, you think the mistake is, uh, I think it's B. No, it's not B. It's uh, it, it's uh, yes, it's yeah, yes. Yeah, sorry, sorry, it's B. Uh, I I yeah. I was just reading yeah, something it's... else. Yeah, the ability because yeah. this is subject, so it's the. Sorry, I, I was reading something else. I'm sorry for that. Thank you very much, Abdullah. This is a correct answer. And we move now to we said uh, Mesa. Mesa, we have number two. The information. Okay. Uh... Number two separation and the various types of books and these in the rules would useful. So where is the problem? Number? Uh, with uh, uh, C. Number C is the error Y. Because mm, the singular because it could subject, be is singular. subject is singular all the time, yes. Thank you very much. Now we move to... I will move now to Fatima, and then Ali, and then Shireen, and then Amira. Fatima first. Compared to the number of paid holidays... To the number of, <coughs> sorry. Compared to the number of paid holidays enjoyed by most employees in the company, three weeks of vacation seems generous. I think yes. yes, this is tricky. This is word usage. In fact, you should say compared with and not compared to because compared to and compared with one of them compares two things which are different. It's compared with. Compared to it's something similar. Two things are similar. But here we have two different things, it seems to be. Thank you very much, Fatima. Anyway, it's difficult. We moved now to Amira and then to Ali and then to Shireen. Amira, please, number four. The essentials was a structure of the organization. Um, number zero, the stem. What do you have here? Um, um, uh, the uh, they, uh, just simply, we have, the, no, no, we don't, we, 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 we don't, I don't want you to think this way. Whenever I say, what do you have here, immediately say, check for subject, verb, both present, neither repeated. You have to memorize this. Now, more okay. important than the, the word itself is, is the, the rule, the rule that's behind this word. Thank you very much for you, and I would like now to ask uh, Amira, and then Ali, and then uh, Shireen, let's not forget. We have Amira first, yes, please. Number five, Amira. Hi, um, the large ones. Um, attract, uh, attract, uh, number B. Yes, simply because we have the subject because. agreement we have the problem with together with we don't look at together with we, we look at become what comes before it, this. which is this singular is. red house is singular it's not plural and after amira i think we have ali and after ali we will have uh, shireen so let's see ali number six ali and we're still on page 158 for those who do not have the books uh, number six is uh, snake uh, eggs are Thus, and baby snakes are survival long at birth. Neither the eggs or newborn snakes need protection by the mother. I think the mistake is, is D. D. No, you're wrong. It's not yeah. D. I'm sorry. Because we said in the past, if you remember, when you have neither nor, we do not look at uh, what comes before neither whatsoever. We but, apply the principle yeah. of proximity, so there's no problem. Need is plural and snakes. What's your problem with this one? What's wrong with this one? See? Do we have neither? 
neither the eggs nor a newborn. We don't say neither or. It's neither nor. So this is the mistake. And the mistake here is what you said again. It's not or. It's not. Thank you very much, Ali. And we would like now to move to Shirin. We promised Shirin that she talks. Yeah, in number seven, the problem is with C because leave the the plural for the leaf is leaves. So you have the problem with word form. It should be leaves. This is what we call word form. Thank you very much. Now we move to number eight, and I think I will give the floor now to Maha. Yes. Mm -hmm. Um, we will amend he because it is uh, repeated. The, the subject is repeated. Subject it was told. for the subject and verb both present neither repeated. Yes, it's repeated. Thank you very much. You gave the correct answer. Now we move to nine and ten. Who would like to do nine? I think uh, we have uh, Amira. Please. Number nine, Amira. Uh, nine, okay. Mm. Um, I think uh, related number C. Number C, no, there is nothing wrong with number C. Uh, just remember, uh, when you, uh, when you, whatever you have a sentence, just think about the easiest things. Subject, uh, okay. Verb both is not uh, repeated, I... and then say, check for the subject. Verb agreement form and tense, and then you move downwards in the list. Okay, uh, was yes, okay. Number A, number A, because the singular, the end, uh, singular subject, yes. Thank you very much. This is a correct answer. And number 10, number 10 says that present advertising is one of the most strictly regulated industry in the United States, and we have somebody to answer this question i'm not sure who would like to answer this question okay i'm lowering now all hands the first one who raises his 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 yes it is amira 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 is the first one who raised her hand so amira will talk uh, i'm not sure but uh, i think um uh, number A? Um, no, I'm sorry. It's a mistake. It's D. I'm sorry to frustrate you. And by the way, once you are able to see the mistake immediately with, uh, within just very, very few microseconds, then you will be able to master the English language. And this is what I encourage you to do with this book. It's simply industry. It should be industries. It's word form. Thank you very much. I'm sorry to disappoint you. We have other examples and other rules. I would like to ask you to read them at home because uh, you're all at home. But uh, anyway, I'm not going through them. I'm going just to see now the last exercise. In this chapter, it's going to be on page 160. 160, and we would like to start again with the first one who raises his hand or her hand who would like to talk. Is there anybody who would like to talk? We have Ali. Yes, Ali. Uh, sorry, I want to uh, return back to previous exercise, uh, to sentence uh, number three. If you could insert uh, sentence number three, I think that... 158? Page one. Uh, 158. I think the wrong with C, not with the A. If I correct or not. Uh, I'm not sure what you're talking about. Is it number three? Yeah, yeah, number three. I think the incorrect... Uh, no, you're wrong. It should be yeah. compared to. What's wrong with that? Three weeks of vacation seems generous. What's wrong with C? I think we are, we are talking about, if we are talking about three, uh, three 200... Uh, it's a period of time. Three it's weeks. Singular. It's always singular, not plural. It's always singular. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Exactly. I know, I know it's frustrating, but this is English anyway. If you like <laughs> okay. English, it's okay. You can do whatever you want. But not. 
Okay, do you have anything to add here in 160, I think? Do you have anything to say here? Okay. No, that's it. Thank you very much. I think we will move to another person. I'm now lowering the hands. We have Abdullah Amush. He will answer the question. Yes, Abdullah, please. Number one. Yeah. The party couldn't be called success because so few people that had been invited actually came. I have... Maybe I will change success to succeed. Let us change success into successful so that it can work better. So it should be successful or a success. Yeah. Yes. Thank you very much, Abdullah. You were right. Yeah. yeah. So the uh, Johnston family have been living in a tiny apartment since they moved to town last September. And I think we have Sarah with us. Sarah, please, yes. Yeah, I think the mistakes with, uh, with B since they moved to town last with B. So it should be moved because it is verb, which is what we call verb yeah. uh, form and tense, etc. Thank you very much. You made the correct answer. Now we move to number three. And number three, who would like to do it? I'm just lowering your hands again. Lowering your hands. Just the first one who will raise his hand or her hands will answer the question. Mesa, yes, please, Mesa, you have the right now to talk. Please. I uh, have been searching. Uh, over, over the, the few, past few over the years, past few years medical researchers have been searching. This is what we call verb form. In other words, the form is wrong. We do not have English anything called have searching. It's have been searching. Thank you very much, Mesa. You gave the correct answer. Who would like now to answer number four? We have Fatima. She raised her hand first before any other person. Yes, Fatima, the floor uh, is yours. The pilot that was killed in the crash maintains not maintains so Maintain this is once again subject uh, not the subject sorry it's a verb form thank you very much it should be maintained because he died you cannot say about the person who's living uh, who's dead that he maintained number five who would like to do number five please ali you are the first one to raise your hand so let's give it to ali do you know the answer for number five you have to unmute yourself you're always forgetting so yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. I think the problem with four, uh, number eight. For some time now, television advertising is tightly controlled by the Federal Communication Commission. What's wrong with four? I don't know. I do, uh, but I think it's it's the wrong with four. Okay, I would like just to ask somebody else to confirm whether this is num number A or not. Thank you very much, Ali, but I don't agree with you. So, who would like to talk about number five? Number five. Amani, yes, she would like to say something. Uh, yeah, I believe it's B, uh, advertisement. No, I'm sorry to disappoint you. It's not B. Sorry, oh. sorry, sorry. I'm sorry, Amani. And I will just ask another person now to answer. Amina, yes, Amina wants to say something. Amina, what's wrong with your microphone? It's not working. I cannot unmute you. Your, your microphone is betraying you, so to speak. So I'm sorry, we cannot talk because I'm just trying to unmute you and it's not unmuted. I don't know why. So we have with us now, who would like to answer? Abdullah, uh, what do you think, Abdullah? Yeah, I think it's D, but we can use being controlled. Is it right or not? Um, like for some time out, advertising is mm, tightly being Sorry to disappoint you. you. No, you cannot say being controlled. I'm sorry. Okay. Very sorry for that. Amira would like to give us the right answer. What's happening with you? It's five. It's very easy. Amira, yes? Uh, uh, I think the uh, number you will see was. Was? Are you sure it's because. Uh, it isn't was. Because uh, the tense um, for some time now. Uh, 
I'm sorry to disappoint I... you. You cannot say was here. No, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, Amira. I'm just trying to tease you, maybe. Maha, is that very mm -hmm. difficult to say which one is wrong? What do you think? Okay, um, sometimes artificial advertising is quietly controlled. Um, I believe that we should the use has been quietly controlled by the field of communications. Just to give me the right answer. Yes, it should be has been tightly controlled. This is verb form and tense because you cannot say for some time now. Oh. Is it started in the past and still at the moment continuous? Thank you very much, Matt. You made us our day. In fact, this is it must be has been has been tightly controlled by the Federal Communications Commission because we're talking about something starting in the past and still in the, in the present, possibly in the future. So the cost of groceries have risen to so rapidly. <clears throat> Who would like to answer this question? I'm lowering your hands and Abdullah Mush is the first one to say yes. Yes, Abdullah, you have the microphone. Yeah, uh, the cost of groceries have been rising. Risen. Uh, or, yes. I'm sorry. Yeah, but I think it uh, has been rising. Has risen, right? not has been risen. Has risen, and this, this rule is called verb agreement. Thank you very much, Abdullah. You gave me the correct answer. And now we will move to another person, and this person is going to be Fatima, the first one who raised her hand now after I lower them. Number seven, Fatima. Uh, after the horse had thrown the jockey several times, its owner decided it was best to withdraw from the upcoming race. Uh, had thrown the jockey. So this is verb thrown. form. Yes, it is verb form. There is something wrong with the verb form. Thank you very much, Fatima. And now I move to number eight. Number eight, who would like to do it? Nobody who would like to do it. Mesa has raised her hand first. I'm sorry. One moment, one moment, one moment. It's Mesa who will answer the question. <coughs> yes, Mesa. Okay, number eight. Although the typewriter was extremely, it is the word form. Word form state. Extremely, so it should be ex extremely, not extreme. This is word form again. Number nine, and who would like to do number nine? Please raise your hand, and the first one will get. We have Mesa again, uh, not Mesa, I will not give you the floor now, I will give it to Shireen for instead because you talked. Shireen, yes. Yeah, number nine, Christianity has become a worldwide religion since it has become almost 2,000, uh, um, instead of almost, we can say, um, Sorry to disappoint you, there is nothing wrong with almost. Sorry for that. Now we will move to someone else, and this someone else is going to be now who's going to say. Oh, Abdullah is always raising his hand before everybody else. Yes. <laughs> yeah, Christianity has uh, became. No, I'm sorry to disappoint you. You're wrong. I'm now lowering the hands again. Yes. Who would like to say? Who would like to save the day because we have so many mistakes so far? Ali, yes, Ali, you can say something. What do you have yeah, to say? I think uh, I think the wrong with C. You say C. There's something wrong with it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It has uh, been uh, be become become. It has been become, there is no such a thing in, in, in English which there has been become. Something is wrong now with the whiteboard, I cannot uh, really write anything and I hope that I I have not lost what I have written in a way, as usual. So, do you have the books? You can see what I, what I wrote. Uh, the bad news is that, as you can see, it simply crashed. What this means is that everything that we have written from the very beginning of the lecture till this now, will be unfortunately lost. So this is the good news or the bad news, I don't know. So anyway, it should be it, uh, it should be in the past simple. I don't remember what it was. Uh, could you please remind me? Because my computer now is simply crashed. Yes, it must be began, as Mona says. Thank you very much. 
So this is the bad news. At the end of the day, we are losing the file that I was writing on the whiteboard. That I was writing everything there. I'm sorry for that. I should have saved it from time to time, but since it crashed down. Uh, that's the end of today's lecture. Thank you very much. Remember, please, that tomorrow there is nothing. We do not have any lecture tomorrow. I'm